Guess who's back? It's me. To do a video that I'll get called a shill for. <laughs> What's up, guys? Okay, so today we're talking about Gotham Knights. This game has been so ridiculously overhated. But I need you guys to understand something, right? With the Saints Row video I did previously, I genuinely thought it was a good game with bugs. And I thought that it was getting some terrible reviews. And I thought that some of the like stuff that people were coming out with for it was absolutely ridiculous. And you know what? I feel the same here, but it's different this time. There's a bit of nuance to this. So I saw this Twitter post, right? Shout out to the Quiver. And I agree with it, right? So Harley looks great and there's like 10 seconds of gameplay. How can you get so angry at this and say this game is terrible combat when it's the very beginning of a boss fight? So uh, just to sort of explain it, this is, uh, this is kind of what it looks like here. Right, so this is it here. So, does all that, right? Comes in, boom, 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 you know, hits the stuff, right? Yeah, it's definitely slow, but I feel like they're trying to showcase the animations more than they are, like, trying to, you know, defeat the boss fight as quick as humanly possible, because then what's the point of the gameplay, right? Um, you know, and, and again, like, I, you know, reading some of these comments, this one right here, I completely agree with. People should just be more honest about their biases. This game doesn't look terrible. It just doesn't look like an Arkham game, and that upsets you, which is fine, but be honest about it. I've got to be honest with you, La. The combat is pretty much Arkham without a parry system, right? And the parrying system in the Arkham games was so easy, right? Like, it was t brutally easy to counter everything, right? The fact that this in this game is pretty much dodge-based is probably better, probably better for a challenge. I'm just going to be honest. I don't really want to stand there for the duration of fights and just press triangle every so often in order to win a fight. Really boring, sort of, like, and, and, and it's just not for me, right? It's really not for me, especially with someone as agile as Nightwing. And that's, you know, I get it, right? I get it. Yeah, okay, the gameplay wise them playing it not exactly the best thing in the world right the developers are not good at playing their own game sure but it doesn't look bad there's just some angry bias there like again it's the same thing as saints row writing it off because it doesn't have batman in it um my friend here horn said i spent about three seconds looking at comments and already wanted to off myself <laughs> uses the same battle system as avengers just 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 false just false, to be honest, just false. Avengers is so different to what we've seen here. I've got to be honest, I think Avengers combat is heavily overrated. Uh, it's not bad, not bad. It's just very basic. Um, but if you're going to say it's worse or uses the same battle system, like the thing that Marvel's Avengers has been, you know, pretty praised for is its combat anyway. Um, but even if you're like me and think it's overrated, it just doesn't look the same. It just doesn't. You know, I mean, first of all, it's got parry in Marvel's Avengers as well, you know. Um, someone said here, because it looks like every boss fight in every generic AAA action game, compare this to the first 10 seconds of the boss fights in the Arkham games, no mashing light attacks on a spongy health bar. But, like, the Arkham games were pretty spongy. Like, you know, especially the sort of bigger enemies. There was a lot of sponge in those games. And again, like, like, um, like this post says up here, it's because it's not Arkham that, you know, these comparisons are kind of being made, right? Um, you know, and again, and again, like, you know, people, people moaning about Harley's, like, appearance. Do you want this? Do you really want this? Like, this, this, I'm not being funny. This makes it like a porn parody. This looks like a, like, you know, this looks bad, in my opinion. You know, it looks, it does. It looks absolutely awful. Um... And I, I'm just glad that they're not doing that. I'm glad that they're going for something different. It is a bit strange. Like, it, it is a little bit weird. Don't get me wrong. But still, man, it's, you know, it's it's uh, it's one of them things. I'm sorry, but this game looks ugly visually and clunky. I just don't, I don't know what gameplay people are watching. I really don't. You know what I mean? I don't know what, um, I don't know what people are watching. I don't really understand it. Because to me, Gotham Knights has looked n mid at worst. Right? Um, definitely not going to be the greatest game of all time or anything. But again, I just think people are writing it off because it's not Arkham, because it doesn't have Batman in it and just a bunch of different stuff like that. Like, you know, wait until wait until more people get, uh, you know, a hit on this thing that I'm putting on screen now of Batman chucking Clayface into a reservoir and having him chopped up. People are going to lose their minds. They're going to think, oh my God, Batman's a killer. Batman's a killer. Without the context, right? We're probably going to get a lot more context in the game. 
but people are gonna say, oh my god, they, they made Batman a killer. Like, it's, you know, the internet is so quick, bro, to just decide they hate something. And I think that that's really tedious, and it's just one of them things that I'm just, I'm over, right? Which is why I'm making these kind of videos. It's, it, it's, it's really boring. But that's it for today. Uh, <laughs> subscribe if you want. Jesus. Bye.